Welcome back, everybody. We are back. Uh, show's been moving great so far. Uh, in case you're uh, wondering, tomorrow night, we're going to have Janine Garofalo from Reality Bites, actor Stephen Baldwin, and we're going to have a spoken word performance. That's tomorrow at 7. But meanwhile, my next guest has made quite an impression with her, uh, with her acting talents. She's currently starring as a wanton love slave in the film The Getaway. Please welcome Jennifer Tilly. They had these really detailed instructions on how to get out to the stage, and yeah. you guys let me use my own initiative. It's and like, you did marvelously. there's the stage, you see it, just, you know, go out there, step up, hi. I tried uh, to stay oh. away from your show, <laughs> but uh, here I am, I couldn't resist. <laughs> they, when you first started your show, they say, call them, they said, do you want to be on the Jon Stewart show? And I was like, why? And they said, well, we'll tell you why. You plug in this video cassette, and you look at it, and I plugged it, and I was out of the room, you know making coffee and stuff like you do when you're a single bachelorette living yeah. alone. <laughs> I came back in the room and you said, this is how far we can go on MTV. And there's a man's butt on the screen, a really unattractive butt. You're such a good conversationalist. Not that unattractive. It was nice. It was manly. I don't like any butts. Can I? But I okay, it was a fabulous butt. Can I? It was, no, okay, but the, in the context, okay, in the context, Come back here. No, don't, don't, don't do that. That happened to me before. Uh -oh. It was terrifying. I can't imagine why. So, let me, uh, I just wanted to say, so they, you, this is what you said. Uh -huh. In case some of your viewers out there have not seen this, you said this is how far you could go on your for some kiwi? I don't want kiwi. I don't want anything for New Zealand. Right. Oh, our director, Roger Donaldson. Whoa. Your audience hates me already, and I haven't even started. But look, I have a fabulous outfit on. Jennifer. But I heard when, you're you're an available bachelor, and I'm I'm doing the single life, and I turned on the show last night, and it was a rerun of Car No, it wasn't a rerun. <laughs> and you took your shirt off, and you had very interesting chest hair patterns. <laughs> uh, Can I ask you? Wow, what is going on with your audience? You're I not even a real audience. So you're like, Jennifer. <laughs> To say, what? They're small, but they're rowdy. They're enthusiastic. But they listen, like when you come here. out of your shell, what? I think you're really going to be able to talk to them. <laughs> you um, had some questions for me. No, I don't have any questions. Listen, you go right <laughs> ahead. You are doing a tremendous job so far. Oh. I'm enjoying this. No, what is this? This, this is, is like, like the many National dates. Hockey League. This is a, a knock table. Many dates. What kind of dates? The kind of dates where you say, "Oh, well, I'll call you later." The kind of dates where you say, "Wow, this girl has some energy." I don't know what you're talking about. You said. But, um, you said you said the show was like many dates. I did? Yes, you did. When did I say that? You just said it a minute ago. Really? You said, you know, Marlo you Thomas were listening to me? met her future husband on a talk show. So let that be a lesson. You watch what you say. All right. Okay. So far, I haven't said anything. <laughs> well, you watch it. How's, how's your movie going? It's going. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. Okay. So am I. <laughs> We had Michael Madsen on. Yeah, right. no, you were not supposed it, to say that. Oh, right, I'm they sorry. They took me aside and they said, don't mention Michael was on the show because oh, that okay. episode is at Standards and Practices. Oh. They're going through it with a fine tooth comb. He kissed me flat on the mouth. Boom, I heard that. Snapper. I heard that. He's very uninhibited. Yeah, he's desperate. Not desperate. Oh, <laughs> no, 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 Michael. I well, don't, you had no, a sex I scene. Michael. I had a sex scene with him. Uh huh. And, um,. <laughs> Did, that, did, did you know that was going to happen, or did they spring that do on you in the original thing? I like do with you, okay. believe me. <laughs> um, but you? yeah, okay, so yeah, no, they wrote, when I <laughs> auditioned for this part, uh -huh. and everybody was saying, Jennifer, Jennifer, we want to make sure you're okay with the sex scene. And so I turned to page 67 where the sex scene was, uh -huh. and it said, Just says sex Fran, scene? And no, no, uh -huh. it said scene 67, page 67, and it uh -huh. said, Fran is lying on her side, and Rudy, that's Michael Madsen, is in bed next to her, and the sun is coming. Me up and her husband, Fran's husband, is tied to the side of the bed. Oh. And so it just, it kind of suggests they spent the night together, but in a very tasteful, sort of subtle, discreet way. Sure, tasteful, way. tie your husband to the side of the bed kind of a way. That's, That's right. Uh, and I thought, I can handle this. 
Sure. I thought I'll be lying on my side, I'll drape the sheet in a really artistic way over my supine body. Oh. And I thought, it'll, it'll be, I'll pretend like I'm asleep, I'll close my eyes so I won't even have to see myself naked. And I said, it'll be easy. Uh -huh. I'll, I'll get through it. Piece of cake. So anyway, everybody kept saying, are you sure you're okay with this? Are you sure you're okay with the sex scene? And when I went to the audition, the director blocked me from leaving. That's like the first time, one of the first times somebody blocked me from leaving you. He said, I, I certainly won't. He said, Jennifer, before... <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yes. I'm kidding. I, I swear know to God. you are. I'm just trying... I know you are. Uh, You're fascinated by me. I, I can tell. I really am. Okay. You have no idea. I truly am. <laughs> so, I'm anyway... You eat kiwi while you talk. Yeah, have some kiwi. It's good. Go yeah. Ahead. Keep going. I like when a host is inject... And is, um, eating nutrition while I'm talking. All right, fair enough. I tried to form a sentence, but it didn't work. Listen, not a problem. Okay, so anyway, so I get the part. I'm driving, I'm flying down to Arizona, and I'm reading the script, and I turn to page, like, 56, and it says, Harold, that's my husband, Yeah. hears a banging, screaming noise coming from the other room, and he's tied to a chair. Uh -huh. He hops his chair into the other room. Uh -huh. He sees Rudy... And Fran making mad animalistic sex on the Score! <laughs> And the stewardess said, is anything okay? And I said, I I'm flying out to do this scene that I'm really not prepared for. Wow. Well, it's, it, it sounds great. But it was um, really... Oh, do you have to go? I he think has so. To go. But you can go right ahead. But it uh, <laughs> the movie is The Getaway. I'd like to thank Jennifer oh, Tilly for being here. Oh, you didn't even show the clip. I can't believe it. Oh, really? Yeah. I heard a little we'll short man runs across the stage when you're going to show a clip. <laughs> that happens sometimes. Okay, Thanks to the fabulous to Rachel Hunter for being here Thanks. and the Juliana Hatfield 3. We're going to play us out in a very nice gesture. There they are, the Juliana Hatfield 3. <laughs> Thank you.